hello everyone and welcome back to your own channel technical sahil in today's video we are going to log in a website uh, which is hosted on this shared hosting uh, provided by dreamhost we access the files of this website via ssh means we will log in this website particularly this user particularly this user uh, via ssh through putty uh, putty if you don't know putty is a ssh client through which we can install a server or a hosting it has enabled the cgi access so we can access it just like we access any linux based distro via terminal so this will provide us a terminal screen let me show you in a minute first we have to go to the websites and click sftp users and files From here we need to click on this uh, login info and from here we need to enable this secure shell access. Now this will take a minute of yours, please wait till that. SSH has been enabled, now I simply need to open my PuTTY software. I will also provide the download link of uh, the same. So you can simply download and install it on your Windows based PC. Now here I need to click login info and copy the host name, paste it here. Port number would be same 22. And here we need to change the password. Uh, let me create a strong password and click reset password. Now this will also take few seconds. So till then I am fast forwarding the video. The password has been updated now we simply need to click here open uh, we need to surpass this warning by clicking here the yes now i need to provide the username and the password which i have copied a minute ago and you can see i have logged into my uh, SSH of this particular website if I try to see the files you can see I have only access of these three files not the complete hosting so this is a very important thing especially if you want to share the access of a particular website to someone else so you instead of uh, sharing this uh, complete dream host panel access or uh, access to the root user or uh, admin user you simply need to create this uh, specific user which your developer needs uh, of a specific website or directory and you simply need to uh, provide these credentials and the developer can easily access uh, the website contents and this way all other websites of your will get secure and private if we wish to see the uh, present working directory you can see i am inside home and this user if i uh, change my directory to fiber Hello, tools.com. Now, if I again check the files, you can see that's the same website which we have, uh, which we got when we installed WordPress, uh, fresh WordPress on this website. If I try to see the content or code of any page, let's say index.php. So you can see that's the code of uh, this index.php and this way we can access the website files via SSH. So that's all for this video and thank you so much for watching it till the end.